Okay, I want to show you uh, where to start the um, penny field lock uh, float uh, small mouse fishing trip. So penny field lock um, to Swain's lock uh, small mouse bass float. Float trip or smallmouth fishing bass fishing float trip um, that I just uh, finished uh, today. Okay, so it's very easy. Let me um, show you um, how to do this. You need um, two cards, so and um, you need one card to uh, one part at the downstream downriver uh, swing slock one part at the downriver swing slock um, off the CNO, CNO canal um, and the other uh, car part at the bow ramp at uh, Penny Field Lock. Um, okay, so let me show you where they are. So if you open Google Map and uh, you type in Penny Field Lock Road Potomac. Uh, you can see this is the place, and there is a boat ramp right here. Um, so you can see the boat ramp. Let's go to the Google Earth. Um, I'm just going to yeah make this uh, bigger. You can see you can one car three. Park cars here. So this yes, cool. Ah, that's the GPS coordinates. So I'm just gonna here. Uh, also going to make this bigger so you can see. Make it black and also make it bigger. Alright, so let's go back to the, uh, so here is the bull ramp. So, um, so what we did was we just uh, pedal through this canal, through this underneath this and then this the there's a the boat ramp um, into the blue water and then you pedal through this tunnel here into this channel the channel feeds into the Potomac River okay here is the Potomac River you can see so the next thing you do is um, um, what we did was we uh, pedal up okay so let me do this so we uh, you know and then we pedal up okay we pedal up um, you can actually fish here but there are a lot of grass in here right now so it's very difficult to fish um, but um, you just keep pedal you uh, pedal up it's about 1.15 miles um, sometimes we actually just uh, uh, pedal up to here and in this spot it's very uh, good it's very deep um, so let's uh, and then we pedal um, um, to this corner and then we just keep going down. As you can see it's uh, 1.5 miles already. 
you know, remember this is a one-way flow trip. So 1.8 miles, 2 miles, okay, 2.33 miles. So, you know, you can fish all these places. It's very beautiful. Uh, 3 miles, 3.5 miles, you know. Certainly, um, I, we never did it this way. We never came down from here. Um, I imagine you can do it too. Um, but this is a safer route that I'm sure. Uh, not very many, uh, fast current. So, um, it's actually very safe. Um, you know. Anyway, so that's uh, already you can see it's six miles. Um, you know. Um, oh, I gotta, I gotta find the uh, what do you call that? Uh, I think it's probably here. This. Uh, Swain's lock. Let me put in Swain's lock. Swain's lock. Here we go. Ah, Swain's lock is over here. So you can see here is the Swain's lock. Um, this this red thing here, Swain's lock roll. So there is a parking here, and uh, let's get the. Uh, Let's get the, uh, what do you call that? Let's get the, uh, yeah, so that's the swing slot. So, you know, that, that, that's, that's going too far. So I'm actually going to retrace these. Um, we didn't go that far. We actually just rolled it through. Oops. Here we go. So we uh, came around here and then we uh, came back up this way uh, to Flock Island and this is where we um, came back up and pull up the canoe and then get to our parking lot which is here. So this is the uh, Swain's Lock parking lot where you park uh, one car here. So what's here? Let's do this. So this is the GPS coordinates for uh, Swins Lock at the downriver here. So that's um, Swins Lock. Here we go. So I'm just going to have the GPS coordinates here. Just gonna do a dark color. Okay, so um, you can see uh, those are the coordinates. Um, let's see, 16 maybe. All right, so those are the coordinates. And uh, let me go back to the graph. And you can see it's 5.55 miles. And then uh, here you just uh, take your canoe. Uh, to the uh, to the uh, parking lot over this canal, CNO canal, and then you're done. So that's how we uh, uh, did our uh, our uh, flow trip. Six miles back to here. Six miles. Total distance five point six miles. So depending on uh, how long you uh, fish um, and, and uh, float, if you don't fish, you probably can do it faster. We started at uh, um, at uh, three p.m. Uh, at um, Pennyfield Lock. 
and uh, we uh, finish. at the uh, Swain's Lock at uh, 7 um, 15 p.m. Uh, 7 30 p.m. 7 15 p.m. so it's a, a good four hours uh, fishing trip um, you know because uh, we paddle a lot a uh, good four hours uh, trip uh, for a four plus hours trip. Um, we never anchored. Uh, well, we did anchor a little bit, but uh, so we really just, uh, you know, uh, going downstream and, and fish and uh, so forth. So, as you can see, I'm going to shrink this map so you can see the, uh, the route we took. Uh, oops. Okay. We start from the here and then go up upstream for one mile and then, you know, just float downstream and then to uh, Swain's Lock. We, I never tried, you know, go on this uh, uh, right upper uh, side or right hand side of this uh, long stretch of islands. Um, I think they're... Um, the current is heavier. Uh, uh, I, I think the fishing condition is not as good on, on the right hand side of the island versus the left. That's why we always pedal up for one mile. But the truth of the matter is, a lot of last year I actually pedal up one mile, but then I never floated down to the swings lock. I just did this section. Um, pretty pretty good. I was able to catch quite a few uh, small mouse bass in this area. There are also tons of carps and catfish swimming in the deeper uh, holes in this area. So it's a it's a pretty good uh, decent uh, uh, small mouse float uh, fishing trip that you can easily take. People also float from up here down to where um, I think, uh, tons of professional fishing guy out further as well. So. In any case, so I'm uh, just showing you this uh, uh, fishing trip. Total distance, as you can see here, is 5.55 miles. It's a pretty good today. This afternoon, we had a very good weather, um, and we got out of there before dark, so it was pretty pretty good. We started at 3 p.m. in the afternoon. We we met at uh, Swens Lock at 2:30. You know, it took a, us a little bit to. Uh, load the canoe and everything so you know it's a long trip in any case that's uh, the uh, fishing trip today and uh, certainly we caught a 22 inches uh, uh, bass small mouse bass so you should take a look too